So we have the two episode premiere of The Acolyte, the newest Star Wars series now streaming on Disney+. Plus. So here are some of my thoughts after watching the first two episodes. So one of the things I was looking for with this series was that this was going to be set in a whole new timeline. Basically, they were saying about 100 years before The Phantom Menace. So I was excited about, you know, going to a new timeline, a new time to where we haven't visited before and just getting this new series in that timeline. I think it had a great opening action sequence going on and we got a lot of hand-to-hand -hand combat going on in these first couple two episodes. And I'm liking the hand-to-hand -hand combat kind of stuff and the way they're fighting each other. I'm getting interested in some of the characters so far and, you know, kind of on the way to liking some of these characters you know it's nice to see Daphne Keene come back since I haven't seen her since Logan so it's nice to see her in something and you know we got the uh, main character from the Squid Game coming out in this series where he plays Jedi Master Soul he's a very interesting character but really after watching these first two episodes they have a lot of uh it's kind of slow paced I'll say it's definitely kind of slow paced they're kind of setting some stuff up and for the future of the series and you know I didn't mind the slow pace and I like what they're where they're doing with the first two episodes so far you know there's a lot of intrigue going on it got me intrigued on this whole mystery thing that's kind of going on oh you know, it seems like the Sith is returning or you know there's a new Sith master maybe and the whole mystery behind that who it is and all that is very intriguing to me but honestly uh not perfect episodes but still got me intrigued to keep on watching the series 